If you've got fresh tomatoes hanging around your kitchen this summer, put them to excellent use with this recipe from Bev Cooks. Made with tender chicken thighs and fresh herbs, it's sure to be an instant hit with your whole crew. Ingredients 2 pounds chicken thighs 15 to 20 Roma tomatoes, chopped 1 red bell pepper, diced 4 to 5 garlic cloves, minced 1 pinch crushed red pepper 1 tablespoon. Balsamic vinegar 1 pinch sugar 1 tablespoon. PS5 Digital Edition vs Xbox Series S, Specs Comparison, This morning Microsoft officially revealed their digital-only console, the Xbox Series S, and the specifications of it. Mixed fresh herbs, thyme and oregano, 1 teaspoon smoked paprika, 1 large pinch of salt and pepper, 1 Thai chili pepper, optional, 1 pound bowtie pasta method 1. How does it stack up against the PlayStation 5 Digital Edition? Let's find out. It's easy to assume that the only limitations you might find in a digital-only console would be the removal of the disk drive. Combine all the ingredients, but not the pasta, in a slow cooker. Cook on medium for 4 to 6 hours. In this case, a 4K UHD Blu-ray drive, to cut back on costs. Shred the chicken with two forks and toss to incorporate with the juices of everything. However, the Xbox Series S has actually cut back on quite a few features in order to reach their $299 price point. Fish the Thai chili out before serving. 2. Some of these cutbacks are pretty surprising given that the PS5 Digital Edition remains the same spec-wise as its physical disk drive brother. The Xbox Series S is taking a hit to its overall GPU power coming in at 4 teraflops. Cook the pasta until it reaches al dente, and serve a nice mound of shredded chicken and tomatoes on top. Its memory has been cut back to only 10 GB of GDDR6 RAM. The I.O. bandwidth coming in at slow speeds of only 8 GB at 224 GB per second and 2 GB at 56 GB per second. And lastly, the SSD storage space cut down to only 512 GB, which is not much considering it's a digital-only console and some current-gen games like Call of Duty, Modern Warfare come in at over 200 GB by itself. The only advantage the Xbox Series S has over the PS5 Digital Edition is the CPU speed. PS5 Digital Edition vs Xbox Series S, Specs Comparison Price $299 Unknown GPU 4 Teraflops, 20 CUS at 1.55 GHz Custom RDNA 2 GPU 10.28 Teraflops, 36 CUS at 2.23 GHz Custom RDNA 2 CPU 8X Cores at 3.6 GHz 3.4 GHz with SMT Custom Zen 2 CPU 8X Cores at 3.5 GHz Custom Zen 2 Memory 10 GB GDDR6 8 GB at 224 GB per second 2 GB at 56 GB per second 16 GB GDDR6 448 GB per second Resolution target 1440p, 4K upscaled target 4K, up to 8K frame rate target 60 FPS, up to 120 FPS target 60 FPS, up to 120 FPS ray tracing yes yes storage 512GB PCIe Gen 4 NVMe SSD 2.4GB per second uncompressed, 4.8GB compressed 1TB proprietary expansion card 825GB custom NVMe SSD 5.5GB per second uncompressed 9 gigabytes per second compressed swappable PC grade PCIe 4.0 SSD that runs at 5 gigabytes per second controller Xbox Series S controller PS5 DualSense controller backward compatibility yes yes optical drive none none weight unknown unknown size unknown 60% smaller than Xbox Series 10 unknown Sony has yet to reveal the price of their two next gen consoles however even if the PS5 digital edition comes in at $399 it would still be a better buy than the Xbox Xbox Series S based on specs. Garnish with fresh basil and parmesan shavings. Thanks to Bev of Bev Cooks for sharing this recipe and photo with us. PS5 Digital Edition owners would have more than twice the raw GPU processing power, allowing for native 4K resolutions at 60fps. Be sure to visit her website to discover more family-friendly meals that are both healthy and delicious. Nearly double the storage space on their SSD and no limitations on memory or I.O. bandwidth, allowing for quicker boot-up speed, no loading screens, shorter patch installs, and ultra-high-speed streaming. The PS5 Digital Edition and Xbox Series S are set to launch this holiday.